All right, House of Pain fans, we have news about the upcoming seasons for Family Fun Night for both House of Pain and Assisted Living. This is coming from Deadline. I will leave a link to the article in the comment section below as always. Now, everybody has been losing their mind over the past 24 hours. Uh, no, actually a couple of days because the promotional photo we got with Janine and Curtis in the kitchen of CJ and Janine's house had people losing it because we finally get to see Janine on screen, not just part of her face, not, you know, somebody mentioning her name or, oh, Janine just called or Janine is downtown. We have um, the actual actress back in the show and fans could not be happier. And of course, yesterday we got a clip which was just insane. Not just the twins, but Janine and then Jasmine popped up. So it looks like the first episode coming on tomorrow night is going to be nuts. All right, now let's get to this article. Both shows for Family Fun Night return Wednesday, March 22nd. You know the drill, 9 o'clock HOP and AL comes on at 9.30. Let's see here. In terms of assisted living, Anastasia and uh, Efe and... I don't know who Damian Leak is. Let me see if I can search that name. I'm assuming this is um uh Reginald. Reginald. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, Reginald. So it looks like the triple threat facility members are now series regulars. Okay. And that's one thing I said about the show. Look, no, I won't review season four. It is not anything against the show. You all know I personally love assisted living, but in terms of my audience. Not that many people do. So I will watch the show, but I just won't review it because views just won't match the, uh, it just won't do it. Because remember I did the finale and that barely scraped 400 views. But yeah, I think Assisted Living is great. And one thing I've constantly praised the show for is the fact that it knows how to utilize cast where even when several cast members aren't in a particular episode, even Brown and Cora I think the writers do a good job util uh, utilizing the cast that they do have for a particular episode. And that's one thing, you know, I always like compared to, let's say, The Oval or Sisters, where it felt like every single character had to be force-fed into an episode. If you're a Pokemon fan from back in the day, you remember how um, annoying it was that Team Rocket just had to have a scheme in every flipping episode, as opposed to just having a good episode focused on, you know, a couple of the characters. So, yeah, that'll be an interesting dynamic to see how the series series regulars update will impact the show. Will it have more than one set piece this season? Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll let you know if it does. All right, now let's get to House of Pain. The Payne family continues to face matters of the heart, health, and wellness and boundaries with respect to relationships and parenting head on. Calvin becomes obsessed with coaching his son's soccer team and learns that his aggressive approach may be a case of like father, like son. I mean, th this is Curtis Payne's son. Come on now. W what more would you expect? It turns out that Curtis was also a domineering coach when Calvin was growing up and lost his own coaching license. In addition, Miranda stirs the pot with a self-published novel and has everyone up in arms trying to figure out what's in the book they all assume is a tell-all. Ooh. I wonder if that's the, uh... Yeah, yeah, the synopsis. Cur oh, no, 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 not the premiere. There was another episode synopsis I um, read that said something about Calvin not wanting Miranda to do something, I think due to an opportunity. Okay, Calvin, Laura, and Miranda must address blended family issues, and the pains are finally introduced to Lisa's mother, Dina. I know this character. I remember doing a video. She's Lisa's mother. She's going to show up, see how well off that Malik is, but in reality, he's living with his parents. His parents are well off. It's like that episode of The Cosby Show where Vanessa was talking about how people at school were calling her rich girl and stuff like that, and, you know... Bill and um, um, Claire broke it down how we are well off. We are rich. You're not. So there's that. But yeah, she's going to say that Lisa should, you know, leave Malik and put him on child support or something. 
All right, Jasmine visits from college and the family must get used to the new and evolved young woman she's become and the type of people she chooses to spend her time with. Of the premiere, like New Money, I've already done a video on the synopsis, Curtis suspects the food truck was blown up intentionally and he starts investigating the incident. Calvin must get to the bottom of Calvin Jr.'s mischievous deeds. And then for assisted living, like I said, I'm just going to skip over this stuff because, well, you know, nobody's going to watch my reviews. All right, and that's pretty much it. So with that being said, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Uh, like and subscribe. Follow me on social media, and I will catch you in the next one.